Yo, this is Jay for Straight Smoke Gaming, and in today's video, we're me doing the present video that I originally said was going to come out on Christmas Day, but you know, it was Christmas, uh, I was hanging out with the family, so I didn't end up getting to it, so we're going to put it up the day after Christmas, still a pretty relevant topic, I mean, everyone just opened up their gifts, so let's go ahead and see what I got, um, we like to wish you guys a Merry Christmas here at Straight Smoke Gaming, so yeah, make sure you guys spend time with your families. Don't be grinding Madden too much because you have to spend time with your family. But here, uh, I have 21 presents, 7 small, 7 mediums, and 7 larges. We're going to open them and see what we get. So here, we're opening them. I'm showing you right now. It only says 6 mediums because I have one merry medium. But let's go ahead and start. My plan was to start with the 7 smalls and then the 7 mediums and the 7 larges. But they didn't quite open up like that. I noticed down at the bottom, they were just going in whatever order they wanted to go in. So... Overall, I mean, I pulled some good cards, and I pulled some duds, but what do you expect from the smalls? The smalls aren't supposed to be that good. Um, the smalls, you're supposed to get something little. Mediums are something a little better, and large is the best that you can get. Or, or I mean, I guess. There is an XL present that I did not pull. Uh, that's what I was pushing for. I was pushing for an XL present to open up for you guys. I could not spend over 330k, so on coins trying to get these snowflakes to open up presents i could not get one so i just ended up finishing with seven larges um still it's a i mean good presents here i did pull a lot of good cards um some cards i was able to put my lineups some cards i was able to sell back and get some coins um you guys have not seen my best card yet my best cards coming up i already own that card but I'm, i sold it because i owned the one from the campus heroes this is like this was my second best card that I pulled the ninety three overall. He did end up going into my lineup. Uh, what is this one? That one I did end up selling. So yeah, I mean, I and all in all, I did end up making back some of my coins. Right now, I think I'm selling sitting with two hundred k coins. So I mean, yeah, as you can see right there, I did spend a lot of money. I'm only at five oh five coins now. So yeah, this was not this was not a cheap video to make. This was my best card that I did end up pulling. The 95 overall Richard Sherman cornerback. He is my best cornerback that I have on my team. For Mutt, he is my starting corner. Yeah, so that was a very nice pull. Um, I ended up selling him. So overall, I mean, I'm sure XL Presence pulled better stuff out of. But I do know that my Mary Medium, I did pull something pretty good out of. I don't remember exactly what it was. But, I mean, yeah, it was definitely better than the normal Mediums. But, I mean, like I said, these um, presents, they're all random chance. Like, if you get a small, you sure you could get a really good card, but it's all random chance. I mean, it's just like the same way as when you're getting the, like when you're buying a random present. It's random chance. Or when you're buying a large present, it was random chance to pull an XL. I never did. I tried, but I got a lot of larges. So, like I said, these presents are all random chance. Uh, go ahead. Let us know what you guys got. Or what your favorite card that I pulled was from these presents. I pulled, I opened up 21 of them. So I got a total of um, five or six, maybe four or five. I don't know. Somewhere around there of cards that did go straight into my starting lineup that I was able to use right away. And other than that, I did end up selling some cards back for 200k profit. I mean, I consider that worth it. Um, the 95 overall, he's my best corner. If you go and look at the auction house, he's going for like, I want to say it's over 150K, I think. I don't know. I haven't checked in a couple days, but yeah. Here's an overview. We're going to be going over my best cards that I did end up pulling here. So, sorry, I was over on the, I was on my only cornerbacks. So, my first best card is this 95 overall Richard Sherman. He's my best cornerback. The next best card that I pulled would be the Grady Jarrett uh, right end 93 overall he's in my starting lineup then we got the Vernon Davis as my third best card who is also in my starting lineup and then Dante Fowler Jr. as the next one and then we got Joe Burrow who I sold Jordan Fuller who I sold and Porter who is also in my lineup so yeah overall I'd say it's pretty good um go ahead um comment down below let us know what cards you pulled, um, what you guys think about this. Uh, I'm already starting to save up because I know they do a big thing for Easter. We'll be doing a similar thing for Easter. 
so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video um that's really all we got when it comes to open up presents because they took them out of the game sadly i really like them and so i like the random chance at it but yeah that's all we got go ahead comment down below what you think tell us what you guys pulled i'd love to see what you guys got as always if you enjoy please remember to like and sub for more madden gta and red day content ovi has some videos coming up here the next couple days for you guys and so does orb with a madden one bye guys